welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for all sun, moon, and rising sign. And this is the reading for the Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This has been a wonderful, wonderful energy. Um, it is the first week of May 2017. The week begins from the 1st of May until the 7th of May. I want to say thank you for the support, the likes and shares. Please thumbs up and share these videos. And again, um, connect with us at katycon.com. Um, and please listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. Leave a message because these messages also do help other people when they read it to heal themselves too, okay? Yo, this week is going to be the week of the lovers. The week of the lovers is when we are healing or emotional pains, the emotional blockages that has happened, the sort of a thing is going to be healed and cleansed. So be aware of what is happening and know how we can really in certain aspect of ourselves and how by healing these emotional blockages, how we can carry ourselves forward. Okay. As we go forward, we are looking you are in your energy vibration reading and this is wonderful because the prince of ones comes up and he is moving so uh, for the people between the ages of 21 and 35 it's going to be a powerful week for you guys a lot of stuff is going to be happening so you must be between the ages of 21 and 35 because powerful energy vibrations are coming in for you guys and this is going to help you to move your life further okay this is going to help you for the rest of the people it's going to be a week where it's a lot of transition a lot of situation that you've got yourself in it's kind of playing out in this week so remember whatever we do wrong against each other and this week is not playing out good for you is exactly the karma you give out is returning back to you there's something about justice here the justice is not that you, uh, the, the young people will be be justified over something. The older people, um, 36 and older, a justice is going to come out for you, but it's something that you have called on yourself, okay? So remember that. And sometimes people say, yeah, but what you said didn't come out in the week for me. Because sometimes your energy vibration and sometimes it's coming out, but you're not seeing it. Because most of the time, these things do come out, but you're not really focusing and you're not seeing it because you're expecting something else that, um, that you, something else you were expecting. As we look at Monday, and I'm going to put on my glasses so I can see what's happening. We have the energy. Um, oh, wow. Th 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 there's something happening in the aspect of this week because you guys get the number 10 again. Number 10 is seen as one because 10 is just one basically because zero has no effect. And zero is when the omega two zeros is when source creator wants to get our attention. But basically, the energy of the zero is always source created to trying to awaken us or get us ready. So the one is new beginnings and source creator is trying to show you and guiding you to where he wants or where your blueprint is, 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 is shown. So this is, this is extremely wonderful because what is happening here is that you have the twice no, uh, number 10 in your reading energy vibration. It's all about the light blues, all about the blues. There are two moon in your reading. There is something happening. There are three moons in your reading. So there is something happen. I always look at the moon. When if the moon is in your reading, there is something more powerful and more out of ordinary that is going to happen in this week. Week, yeah. So, um. The only energy vibration is your focus. You have no support in this week. Um, your week is is full of matter, the hurt sign, the water sign, and the hair sign. Okay, so there's a lot of cleansing going on in this week for you. 
as we look at Monday we have the energy of the two of Pentacles I personally love this energy whatever way wherever however it comes up we are always happy when it comes up standing upright because it's your emotional being balanced but yet still your financial situation but yet still a whole lot of stuff that is still happening to you uh, in that part so a lot of wonderful things are happening as we move on and we go further we have the energy vibration of the four of cups and the four of cups is um, you're sitting there being bored remember you need to find um, and to contact why are you sitting being bored there is so much things in life there's so much things that we can do we just need to ask our angels and guide to guide us to where because you're sitting in the middle of a lotus being bored and it, you know connects with the universal angels connect with your guides and angel and stop being bored whatever situation is going on on Tuesday awaken yourself as we look at Wednesday we have the five of cups in reverse I love this energy whenever it's in reverse because it is saying that you're no longer looking um, behind but you're looking forward to something that is just so wonderful so brilliant so understanding so being extremely good that you no longer looking behind you're looking forward the day before you were bored but boredom is good because when you're bored you can come up with these brilliant ideas when I'm bored I do that so and 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 you're no longer looking back and this is extremely good because when you're not looking back and you're looking forward to things in your life you're going to see changes happening the ten of sword is finally falling out your back so all the negative energies and not for everyone because there is certain aspect there are certain amount of you people that are working and have been working with the lower energy and I've been working against other people it's not happening for you okay it's happening for the people who have been positive and who have been really 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 trying to focus trying to be positive trying to do good things for themselves but yet still for others okay because there are people who uh, seems to to, to to want to um, kill the vibration of, of, of another person and you know seriously there is something really not the, the balance of certain aspect you should look at what you give out so um, return to you so for the people who the ten of pentacles the ten of swords whatsoever was happening people were doing you stuff it's about to end as we look at the energy vibration um, for Friday we have the um, queen of swords in reverse the energy of the queen of swords is in reverse and the energy of the queen of swords in reverse is a wonderful energy especially the queen of sword because she has no effect on you up you anymore whoever this queen of swords is this energy vibration of her is no longer has an effect on you on a Saturday the ten of Pentacles comes in you could be hearing you could be receiving a lot of money you could be and, and this money could be coming in and that's why you were so bored because you were waiting on it you had no idea when it was coming message of money will be coming in this situation is going to be really good it's going to elevate yourself it's going to change the whole energy vibration of how you were feeling on Tuesday on Wednesday we have the Queen of Cups in reverse she has been coming up in our readings reverse whatever is happening to her she's not in a nurturing position she's in reverse um, whatever has been happening yeah she is really in reverse somebody else had this energy that she was in reverse whatever is happening with this Queen of Cups um, and she is in reverse there is something happening so as I look at uh, the general energy is that uh, you know most of you are not looking back you're going forward you're moving forward you're moving with ambition and you're moving forward you're going forward you're you 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 are such at the high energy vibration and you're moving forward and taking steps in your life and making something of your life and you're no longer standing back and looking at what had happened as we look at this energy you sat in boredom and I guess the boredom that you sat in 
was trying to help you to understand how are you going to balance your financial situation okay so your financial situation is going to be extremely good because you're going to learn to balance it whatever is happening some people are going to be supported by family um, the support of family is coming in some people are going to be supported in family this situation is going to be good so we need to understand the position that we're sitting in we know that everything is going to be okay and I want to say to each and every person out there whenever you sit in boredom and you get these negative energy vibration these negative thoughts from people and this sort of a situation you must learn and understand that um, this situation that is happening it has to do with the negative energy that people had sent to you it had to do with the negative energies that people had sent to you and with this energy that is coming up and with this that is going to happen for you you need to realize how wonderful it is when the universe can step in and help you to remove certain things and certain aspects from you so you know this is going to be um, the sense of uh, things are changing things are changing around you you're seeing this energy whatever is happening this queen of, of, of cups is the one who had um, um, let this energy um, um, occur so you know this what is happening you need to understand that life is going to really change life is going to be changeable things are going to be moving along new things are going to be happening new things are going to come in your life your financial situation is going to come to a self of balance and your own energy vibration which I love is really just moving you moving you in this week it is the only support and I want to say to each and every person out there remember that love is the only thing that is real and remember that whatsoever you do to someone else you will receive it and the, the, you know whether good or bad maybe that person is not the one and that person will never be the one especially when you do good for people it's not the person who you do the good for will return that good but it's somebody else so you know you need to understand where we are and whenever and if ever this doesn't happen for you you need to understand that you need to change your energy vibration because there is something that is um, not working in your life but the way you are being um, treated and I want to say namaste until next week <laughs>